Hello everyone. In today's video, I am presenting the S-Bot Robot Tom. It can operate in 6 different modes. In this video, I will demonstrate 4 of those methods. The first method is controlling it with joysticks, as shown in the table. The different part of the robot tub can be controlled. Teaching a robot arm involves three steps. The first step is the teaching action, where the operator set a fixed motion path for the robot arm. The second step is the storage action, where the robot arm's control system records the tie actions. The third step is the reproduction of the teaching, where the robot arm repeats the action recorded during the teaching process. The third method involves using wireless communication technology and Internet of Thing IoT technology to control the export arm via Wi-Fi using an Internet browser. The fourth method is controlling it using the export tab.
This robot task for the video was provided by Esport. The briefly introduced Esport, they are a company that produce robotics equipment and programmable device used in microcontrollers. Aimed by developing coding, engineering thinking and skill the new generation through STEM education. They clearly explain how these devices work through tutorials. I received several of their products and the links to those videos are provided in the description below. The robots um, belong to their inventor series, which requires some level knowledge to assemble. However, their education series includes tools that even a young child can be and learn with all while having fun. I include the necessary links to purchase this robot term along with all the details about export the description below. The robot term is programmed using the Arduino IDE software. The process of installing the software, installing the drivers and adding the necessary libraries is explained in their tutorial. Make sure to follow it carefully to properly set everything up. Download the tutorial, necessary program code, and all related file from the link provided below. Assemble the robot arm correctly according to the instruction provided in the tutorial file from export. The tutorial explains everything clearly. So, assembling it is not complicated. Before assembling the robot tab, you need to upload the server19.ino code to the ESP board. Ensure that the battery is connected to power the ESP board before uploading. 
Pre-pressing the servo motor zeroing program is crucial of the smooth assembly of the robot arms structure. If the robot arm is assembled correctly, it will return to this position whenever power is provided, regardless of its state when powered off. As an example, I will show you how to upload a code. All necessary codes have been provided by them. Finally, I want to thank Acebot for providing the robot top. I'll see you soon with another important video.